pass and I don't have anything. What? Oh. It just went airborne. Oh yeah, that's the way to do it. I got the exit. Let's catch him up. Woo! With catch him up fishing with Zach. Ketchum. Look at this fish. Oh catch him up. Is that a koi? Am I absolutely what? Kidding? That is definitely oh, a koi. I don't have a cast and I don't have anything. What? Oh. It just went airborne. Dude, we have to get that thing. How? What is shoot it? <laughs> shoot it in the tail. I'm not shooting that thing. Dude. Uh Bray, what the hell? What? I don't know what I could possibly do unless I snag it. Yes. That's the move. Because if we let it go right now, we're probably not seeing that thing ever, ever it's again. In, this canal is connected to Eternity. It's bright. Oh my god, I don't have any bread. How often do I dump? Yeah, maybe it'll just come to me. Maybe you pretend Dude, to throw something on the water. Oh my god. What the hell? Bro, you could net it right now. I don't have mega net either. That pole net might work. No way. There's a will, there's a way, brother. <laughs> it looks like it's soft skin. Dude, what the hell? It's eating, it's right here. God, I love that I hate South Florida. Look at this thing. I wish we were at a pond right now. <laughs> How many times do I not have at least some bread something though? At least a hook. Hold on. By its tail. It's like... Look. It has its head in there. Don't go deep, don't go deep, don't go deep. Come to the right. Oh. I gotta switch. I gotta get a heavier... I have a... I do have a nice size swim bait. Yeah. Oh, keep your eye. Oh, he's going, bro. He's bright, bright. Damn, bro. No, I can't. This is the oh, classic. I see him. I see him. I see him. I see him. Where? On the oh wow! Yeah, there he is. Oh. Classic South Florida. <laughs> Out here catching iguanas today. Now, I could have definitely smoked that thing with my bow. <laughs> but I don't know how. This is only 15 pound test. I don't really have... If this was braid, I could probably snag him. He's doing weird stuff. <laughs> to be honest. He's doing weird stuff. I'm going to try to just tighten the dragon and, and hope for the best. I can't even see him anymore. Oh, he got my ankles! Lost him. Now, I don't know if this all works. Go away. There's seriously like several hundred of these minnows. I don't know if this trap worked at all. But if you look straight down, there's still hundreds of minnows. Yeah. yeah. There's definitely less than there were. I don't know, I, but I put a trap down to try to catch them because I'm trying to catch them out and send them back where they belong. But I don't know, my friends. We filming, Roberto? Yes, we are. Okay, let's see if the umbrella trap got anything that we wanted to get. Oh, yeah, you definitely got a few. Got a handful. So we don't want the mollies. There's mollies still in here. Where, is there like a zipper on the side? I think I remember there being a zipper on the side. Look, you know what's funny? We caught all of these guys in this trap when they were all just, what's it called? They're all spawning. And now, they're, they outsmarted it. I don't want to get the, I want to keep this over here because there's a baby molly that are still in. Oh look, we eliminated one. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Ew, 
<laughs> mm, tasty. Not good. Look at this thing. I think this is a native to South Florida. Here, check this out. There's a couple of them. That's, isn't that weird? Oh, I think that's called a mud minnow. Is it? It's for a burbot. Can it's you see it? Yeah, they can see it for sure. It's got a weird name. I've caught those before. They have big mouths. They're actually predators. I think they're called like burbot or something. I don't know, but burbot into the monster pond. <laughs> burbot, mud minnow, whatever you want to call it. There's a couple of them in there. Goodbye. Oh, yeah. But we did catch a handful of them. But these are, would be great for bait too. For peacocks? Look at that. They'd be awesome. I should probably get a bucket and just use them as bait to be honest. Look at this guy. <laughs> Look at that. Look how small and tiny. <laughs> but I had this big wad of food stuck in here and I think it attracted a bunch of stuff coming up that pipe because the pipes were clogged today and I could have sworn that I saw claws at the end of the pipe. I started messing with it. Check this out over here. So I was waiting for Rob yesterday. I mean, I was waiting for Rob today, but yesterday is when I was just trying to clear out all these minnows. I was like, okay. I put, put that fish trap in there. I didn't check it at all till today, but check it out. When I came out here this morning, now it's later afternoon. You see that far right? How I already moved it over to the side? You can stay right there. Right here, I moved this to the side because I saw some claws, like literally on the grates in this one. And now these are three separate units, right? So I saw some claws right here. I tried to move it, and as soon as I touched it and I just slid it over, which this just slides to the left. As soon as I slid it over, I did not see the claws anymore. I left it open all day long. I never saw anything out of it. Having all that food just stagnant like that in that trap just probably made that scent just continue to continue to come. Most of these fish, anything that comes from that pocket pond, all these guys eat it and it's over. So I set this thing up perfectly, but you never know what was flying up here. So weird. Hello, little guy. Hello. Now these guys are almost trained by now with food and stuff. So check this out. But that leaves right here. Now, if this is the far right one, this is the far left one. So it would be. I think it would be this one actually. I think it'd actually be that one. But I didn't see anything. Let's try to flush these things out. See if see if anything comes today. It's, not, it's just so weird. Literally, I could have sworn I saw claws. Now it could have been a rat, could have been anything. Look at the size of that too. You know, this is fresh air. And those other two are underwater. I don't know, we're gonna find out. Dang, that's sharp. Let's try that. I'm gonna try to flush out this one. See what it is. Let's see what's going on. Let's see if anything came out. Come on. The water flow should be a little tougher this time. I'm pretty sure that one is to that exit. Now I saw the claws on the one to the left, but I left that one, I pushed it. I I didn't see anything. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Let's move this to the side. Let's t let's put on that power. Let's put on the power pump and push this as hard as we possibly can and see what happens. Come on. Whatever it was, I don't know. But we're going to find out. Don't get pissed at me, guys. Okay. So what I'm going to do, if this thing can even fit that one, is I'm just going to shove this down as far as I can, and then I'm going to give it juice. Oh, yeah. 
and then I'm just gonna use this to power flush as hard as I possibly can. And hopefully that water just goes shooting down. Oh, did that, did that go farther? Oh yeah, oh dude. Oh yeah, that's the way to do it. On this one, it didn't go back that far. <laughs> okay. It's definitely working one way or another. That's pretty far down there. That was like, that's like 20 feet of hose. Okay, so now I'm gonna plug this bad boy in. And we're gonna see, hopefully it just pushes that, that water out and does something cool. All right, so why don't you go over to the exit hole? Yeah. And then see if anything comes out. I'll tell you when I plug everything in, right? Yep. Go ahead. Get out of my way. Leave me alone. Let's see here. Okay. Yeah, I hear you. I'm ready. Uh -huh. Ready? We have power. Let's see how this do. I should have brought a net. I don't know why it doesn't want to focus on the pipe. There we go. You can come from this angle too. Oh, I, I got it. Up. No? I got the exit. It's pushing. Oh, it's you pushing. Yeah, it's pushing now. Still nothing. You hear it burping? Yeah, I do. I mean, that pipe is pushing hard. Come over from up, up here. That way, if it catches, if it, if it runs, or it's a mouse, or whatever it was, stand right over there, and now we, then you'll be able to see it come out. If it's anything. It was definitely this pipe, though. I got the right pipe. So check it. We gotta check all these pipes. It sounds like something. Is that the pipe? I wonder if we can keep on pushing, like piping. You know what I mean? Like if we can keep on pushing piping. I can't imagine something would be that strong unless it was actually like a rat or a possum that crawled in there. I don't know. I just saw a leaf come out. Never saw that leaf before. That pump is pushing water, dude. Might have to just log, log into the pump. Here, actually, you come right where I'm standing. Then I'll switch and go on this side. Did anything come out? I don't think so. I mean, you were here, right? Yeah, I was here. I didn't see none. What are these ducks doing? Um, <laughs> yeah, those are <laughs> distract, they're distract, they're distract. There's no other way to get in there. You stay here. I'm gonna, uh, I don't want to move and then something jumps out of here and like, <laughs> 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 these ducks are distracting. Oh my god, calm down, bro. They have kids. There's kids watching. Oh my god, yo. God. Those are females too. They're both females, yeah. We fighting over somebody. Somebody cheated. <laughs> I think it was Chad right there. You see Chad? Chad, bro. Come on, dude. I don't know. I don't see anything. Same thing that happened to that last one. Maybe if I turn the pipe up, it'll drown. And then we'll have to go one way or another.
I wonder if I send something down. You know, like a. I kind of want to send it like a piece of plastic down. See if it goes through. Let's do that. I'm gonna um, keep your eyes on this. Yep. I'm gonna send uh, just a, one of these pieces of flag. Flaggy. Okay. Grab a little piece of orange, just a little piece. Check it out. I'm just gonna grab a little piece of this. So keep an eye. Oh, look, a turtle! Oh, oh. <laughs> it was a turtle! Dude. <laughs> Check this out, come on the other side. Let me see if this was the same claws. Because remember, it was the other pipe that I saw the claws. Ah, uh, what? It was this! It was something like this. Look at the claws, zoom into the claws. Zoom into the, can you see him? Yeah. You see those little claws? So I thought that was like a mouse or like a possum or something. So all that food, because I left it overnight, which I almost never leave extra food because all those fish just eat and eat and eat, unless I'm like overfeeding them, which I'd never do, because I don't want an ammonia spike in case the pump shut off. Look at this guy. I want you to see this claws. What kind yeah, of turtle I is that? even closer. Well, this is definitely a three-stripe musk turtle. You know what this is? Yeah. I've seen a three-stripe muff turtle? Musk. 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 You said muff. That's funny. <laughs> <laughs> Look at his little claw. Come here, buddy. So this turtle climbed all the way up this to that pond. And I saw his little claws, and I thought it was a rat. Look at his little claws. Come here. Let me see your little hand. Come here. I don't want him to bite me. Gonna three strike the muff is gonna get me. <laughs> Don't get me. <laughs> but yeah, his claws. Could you see him? Yeah. You did see him? Yeah. His claws are what I definitely what I saw. Come to think of it. So he had his claws at the gate. I don't know if he was eating or smelling the food coming from that other trap. But it sounds about right. This thing came flying out. He must have been like, what is <laughs> happening? <laughs> what I turned on that pipe I wonder if he left and then went I wonder if every pipe has one the yeah, hundreds that was the only turtle that came out I wonder how many turtles are in there I I didn't see anything but then again I didn't wait this long you know I just assumed whatever would be in there would just fly out so there might be turtles in all of these but if it's this small can it it can fit up. It definitely could. A turtle this small can literally go up and turn around. <laughs> that is so funny. So they, they could be in and out of here and it wouldn't affect anything. So this guy, actually, I'm just going to let you go right here. Be free, brother. Enjoy the holes. You can go in and out, do as you please, but you won't be able to make it into the pond. Even if I have that hole. It's, can't, it's not big enough to get through even if I left it completely open. That hole has a square cut out in the middle and there's no way that guy could fit in there. He's just a little too big. That's so funny. <laughs> Come on, chicken. Come on, chicken. Tommy, attack. <laughs> Show these turtles who's boss. Come on. Yes. Fight. <laughs> Guys, we're just out here messing around. Regular maintenance makes a video sometimes. <laughs> you never know what you're going to see just in your backyard. I mean, just today, we're waiting around. I tried to give that trap a couple extra minutes since we already let it go overnight. We found a koi. We've got all those iguanas. It was a crazy day today, but we're chilling. Just letting the time go by. I think we're going to try to go after that koi one more time, though. He'll be fine down there. And you can turn around. Yeah, 4G chilling. chilling guys, stay tuned for the next episode guys. Whew. Get him out. Got you boy. Is it filming? Yep. Came back here later in the afternoon with Jordan. Snag this boy. You really do catch them all. Hell yeah. That's so crazy. Come here, come here. Come here. This thing is big. It literally took you a minute. <laughs> I mean, that's what I do with the gator. It's so sick. Look at this thing. Come on over here. Snag, hopefully, he covers his nest. The little one. 
Look at that fatty. Wow. Luckily it was white. I mean, we wouldn't see that at all. There's a little couple speckles in front. Came back out here. Came back out here and snagged that boy. <laughs> Rob was gonna be pumped. Rob was like, no! We, he wanted to come back out. But his girl was one. I was like, go play with your girl. But I know that boy's soft. You saw him, Rob. We got him. Good job, Snake. As you know, these guys are invasive. So we try to get them out before they get seen by FWC. Then they get shocked and sent to an eternal grave. But this guy will let to live in probably a wonderful home with me or with someone else. He has some Jinrin on him. Pretty cool. Nice snake. It went deep. I wish I could. I should have just filmed the whole thing, but it was it. Catch him up. Woo! Get him up!